Hey everyone, Ryan from Foxtech here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the iPhone cleanup feature, and we'll cover two different meanings of this. One is a new photo cleanup tool that Apple has introduced but hasn't released yet, and the other is how to clean up your iPhone's storage to free up space. Let's dive right in. First, let's talk about the photo cleanup tool. Apple recently announced this as part of their new AI suite called Apple Intelligence. This cleanup tool is designed to remove objects from photos, making it easy to edit out things you don't want in the background. However, this feature isn't available yet, and when it does launch, it will only be available on specific iPhone models like the iPhone 16 series and the iPhone 15 Pro models. Unfortunately, if you have the standard iPhone 15 or any older models, like the 14, 13, or 12, this feature won't be coming to your device. Now, if you're here looking for tips on how to clean up your iPhone storage, I've got you covered. This is a great way to free up space and keep your phone running smoothly. Here's how you do it. First, open the Settings app on your iPhone and scroll down to tap on General. Next, tap on iPhone Storage. Here, you'll see a breakdown of how much space each app is using, along with a list of recommendations on how to optimize your storage. One useful recommendation is to offload unused apps. This feature removes apps you haven't used in a while, but it keeps all your data intact, so when you reinstall the app, everything will still be there. You can enable this by toggling the Offload Unused Apps option. Another great tool here is Review Large Attachments, which allows you to see all the large files taking up space in your Messages app. This can include photos, videos, or documents you've sent or received. Deleting these can free up a lot of storage without losing anything important. You can also free up space by going into the Photos app and removing any duplicates or unnecessary media files. It's a quick way to clear out space without getting rid of anything you actually need. Finally, if you use Safari a lot, it's a good idea to clear the browser cache from time to time. To do this, go to Settings, scroll to Safari, and tap Clear History and Website Data. This will free up space and help Safari run more efficiently. So, whether you're looking to clean up photos with Apple's upcoming tool, or just need to free up space on your iPhone, these tips will help keep your device running smoothly. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and subscribe for more iPhone tips and tricks. See you later.